Carbonio, 2020. Golden Child, let this message be published to the world. Get ready, my children. The time of major disease caused in the laboratory by men is paying off. Beware of liquids. Beware of liquids. My children have suggested you to pray a lot to get away from the world of things and to live serenely in your homes together as a family. The powerful of the earth are providing for the extermination of humanity. They are completing their evil plans. 2020 This scourge is one of the many which are going to follow each other one after another. To try you until you will raise your eyes to heaven recognizing that he who created you is the one true God. Repent ye soon, it all has already started, the fuse has been lit. Trevignano Romano 2020 Children, hear the great trial of faith. As a mother I tell my son the priests, be always obedient to the church, but be careful, because when the consecration of the Eucharist will begin, so will my son, the Lord Jesus. Know that your true faith will be rewarded because I will protect you. Here, the times predicted are upon your heads. New diseases will come where the cure will be hard to find. The earth will continue to tremble harder and harder. Repent and be converted. I will be with you any time we will call on me. We are definitely living the times of the apocalypse. But who is responsible for this situation? The virus has spread from Wuhan, a town where there is a top-level biolaboratory which happens to study deadly and highly contagious viruses. It has been built by China and France in collaboration with Chinese, French and American scientists and WHO, World Health Organization, which is mainly Western, West and East collaborate in this laboratory. In 2019, March, the National Microbiology Laboratory has sent a package of deadly viruses right to Wuhan laboratory through a covert operation. China supposedly upset F for explanation. In October 2019, the major prime ministers of the world got together in New York to the event 201 with the cooperation of once again Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation and the World Economic Forum in order to simulate a coronavirus pandemic situation, which should have started from Brazil and should have caused about 60 million of deaths. On October 15, 2019, they sent to Wuhan 300 American military on the occasion of the Military World Games, that is, the 7th edition of the Military World Games, a global military parade, and it was thought that America took advantage of this situation to spread the virus there, in order to counter China economically. But all of the world has been scored, economically speaking, because of this pandemic, so this theory does not stand. It's like there is a third intelligence who is handling all of this. This unknown entity in one shot with a virus has attacked economy and Eucharist. A material attack and a spiritual attack. Who is the guy? 
Let's see. Ruth the Maria 2015. All of that I've announced you, not only at this time but since times before, is being accomplished. The economy will crumble. Because by means of the economy, the evil rules the world. Man subjects himself to the deity money. And the first thing that the Antichrist will do in order to start his manifestation in front of all mankind will be bring down the world's economy. Here it is. For that by subduing all countries, all people through economy, he will be able to keep them under his control. It's all one project by the Antichrist. Here was responsible for this pandemic. He wants to bring down the economy on a worldwide scale. Carbonia 2011 World Crisis Without Recovery The World Bank is on the brink of failure. There will not be any loan anymore for any country. It's the slavery that Satan has marked for you. Have you not understood yet that his goal is to destroy you? Your sarcasm is now going to be over because you are going to watch your empires die. You are going to watch your assets turn into dust. And with your money, the money left in your pocket, that is, well, with that money you are going to light up yourself a fire if you are still able to survive. Satan wants to bring down the economy and the value of the currency on a worldwide scale. 2015. The economic collapse leads to the fall of governments, and that's when the Antichrist comes in with a single government and a single currency. Economic collapse, and as a result, fall of the governments on a worldwide scale, and everything will be rebuilt in a single united government which we know as the New World Order, with a single electronic currency inserted in the microchip. When this meticulously concocted and planned scenario will be built, the Antichrist will appear as one great point of reference. The coronavirus the 2019 coronavirus wanted by the Antichrist, as we said earlier, has attacked at once the economy and the Eucharist. We can guess that Satan is planning to remove the body of Christ from the churches. Let's see the messages. Carbonia, 2016. Be careful, children. This time the infernal enemy will use the most diabolical weapon he holds, which is to remove Jesus from his altars. He will remove the Eucharist and he will leave the people without my body. Here all intertwines perfectly. Sister Anne 1987 the devil is doing all he can to abolish the holy sacrifice of the Mass. My divine mercy still gives my ministers the time to atone and ponder. Luth the Maria 2013 The evil will lead you to the Antichrist, to reject the word of my son and prevent you from receiving the body and the blood of my son. It will close churches and forbid my worthy and faithful priest to carry out the Eucharistic sacrifice. Marcaibo, Venezuela, 1995 I have already told you in the past that Satan wants to destroy the Eucharist. Here it is. We live in the times of the return of Christ. Soon the Eucharist will be taken. The second coming of Jesus, as I've said earlier, is anticipated by two cycles of seven years. 
If all fits in with what's been said, the Eucharist will be removed during a period of seven years. Gospel Daniel 9 And he shall make a strong covenant with many for one week. And for half of the week he shall put an end to sacrifice and offering. And on the wing of abominations shall come one who makes desolate until the decreed end is poured out on the desolator. One week. In the middle of the week, the Eucharistic body will be removed. In the first half of the week, there will be the presence of the Eucharistic body. In the second half of the week, there will not be the Eucharistic body. Question, how long is half a week? Daniel 12 From the time that the daily sacrifice is abolished and the abomination that causes desolation is set up, there will be one thousand two hundred and ninety days. One thousand two hundred and ninety days are exactly three years and a half. Half a week lasts three years and a half. One week lasts seven years easy. Also in the Gospel it is written that the Eucharistic body, the Eucharistic sacrament, will be removed during a period of seven years, which, as we said before, anticipates the return of Christ. Everything fits in perfectly.